Buy it, use it, break it, fix it, trash it, change it, mail, upgrade it, charge it, point it, zoom it, press it, snap it, work it, quick, erase it, write it, cut it, paste it, save it, load it, check it, quick, rewrite it, plug it, play it, burn it, rip it, drag it, drop it, zip, and zip it. Hello, YouTube fans and people alike. Today I would like to, um, to show you something that I found out and an app that I found on the Android market. Uh, I've been an Android user for about 3-4 months now. Uh, came from an iPhone. And I discovered, a bit like jailbreaking, you could apply ROMs if you like um, to these Android phones. So I got onto my you know, XDA and discovered all these great ROMs. And one which I am sporting at the minute, in case you already can't tell, is... I believe you've pronounced that Cryogen mod uh, for the Desire S, as you can see, uh, with Android 2.3.5. And this app that I discovered basically allows you to theme your phone, as you can see down here. Will it focus? Why do those clouds come up? Uh, I've got like a Touch Whiz from Samsung phones uh, theme going on right now, which I'm pretty liking. And uh, okay, so we'll start off with what the app's called. It's called Theme Chooser Themes, and I will put a link to it in the description. And <coughs> sorry about that. Basically, what it allows you to do is, in fact, first of all, when you have a mod like I think this is especially for Cryogen, um, or Cryonogen, or whatever you want to call it, <laughs> um, you have an app bundled with the ROM, uh, which is a theme chooser. Now. The, your base themes is free. You're given this green one, this blue one, and uh, this other green one, which is the system one. Now, as you can see, I've got a lot of other themes. Now, I was wondering where you get these themes from. And this is when I discovered uh, the app called Theme Chooser Themes. Ironic name. <laughs> Now basically what it does is, it will give you all the themes available for, say, your ROM um, CM7, which is what I'm sporting at the minute. Now I believe it's, it's also colour coded, I think green is free, blue is paid and red is something like paid and free. You can filter them, um, we'll have multiple filters, each DPI support, which is what my phone supports, and we have free, and it will give you all the free ones. Now, basically, you can choose any of these themes. Um, I chose probably about five now, probably take me ages. It's called something like TouchWiz, maybe? No, <laughs> Samsung. Right. Samsung, Moto and Sony stock themes. Now you just click on it and it will take you to the link of the website. As you can see it's an XDA uh, developer's website form. Just see, such a slow website this. Right, here we go. Uh, so the APKs are attached. I'll just go right down, I think. No, it's near the bottom. Uh, right, here we are. Now, as you can see, we're sporting a lot of different themes available for uh, the phone. So, I'll just go ahead and click on one here. It should start downloading. Yep, there we go. Click on that. Watch it download. Doopy doopy doo. Wi Fi is really bad on this phone, I find, for some reason. It's just so slow. <sighs> right, there we go, you just click on it. Of course, no application we found. This would happen. Right, in that case you can go in something like a file manager application. Uh, I'll just go into one here. Locate the file that you've just downloaded. Uh, Right, well anyway, say this is it, you want to tap on that, it's going to come up with this. Install in an external app. You're going to want to press install. 
once it's installed you're going to want to go back to the main theme chooser app on your ROM and it should be located within here somewhere as you can see there's a touch whiz and there's WizMod, which is my current one just click on apply or apply the theme say status bar go status bar whatever you want to call it and your theme has now been applied as you can see and also by lots of themes other things like here is themed the whole um, notification bar phone number phone camera isn't odd focusing on that but yeah that's basically something I discovered that I wanted to show you guys you know the ability to theme your CM7 phone and um, in that respect you know some of my favourite themes for it are touch whiz I'm particularly fond of the Samsung um, themes and uh, also I'm pretty liking some other ones as well I'll just give you a quick look at them I'm also liking the Optimus 2x1 uh, that's quite a good theme just apply that there and as you can see some of the app icons have changed so yeah overall a very good and fun way to personalize your phone I hope you like it I'll put the link in the description for the app the theme chooser themes or something like that it's called uh, and thanks for watching guys